All right, so not everyone wants to use Chrome on their Android phones for all of their web browsing. And well, that's what this video is all about. Today, we're gonna to talk about some of the best Android web browsers that you can use on your Android phone. So without wasting any time, this is Gaurav, you're watching Iron Tech, let's get started. Let's start off with the most no frills, no nonsense, to the point browser, which is called Firefox Focus. As the name suggests, the browser is focused on one thing alone. Help you access the web, get your work done, and that's it. It just comes with a search bar. It does not provide access to your history. It does not come with a homepage that has saved sites based on your browsing. It even comes without an option to open multiple tabs. It is also as secure as it gets when it comes to browsing. It does not track your activities. It blocks trackers as well. And with a single delete button beside the search bar, it deletes all of your browsing history and cache too. But in case you want quicker access to specific sites, you can just add a shortcut of that site to your home screen. It's easy to use and remains absolutely free. Talking further about no frills browsers, we have Orions. Now, the thing with Orions is that even though it can do everything that the other browsers do and it is itself very capable, the thing is, it comes in at a size of less than one MB. Orions is extremely fast and easy to control. It comes with a simple UI. The web page occupies the entire screen with just an address bar at the bottom. You swipe right or left on the address bar to go back or forward. You can switch these controls as well in the browser settings. The browser comes with a download manager and an ad blocker as well. Plus with the flip of a switch, you can disable sites from collecting your data and your search engine changes to DuckDuckGo. And all of this comes in an app size of less than one MB. Now, moving on to the simple ones, let's talk about a browser that looks absolutely amazing. The name of the browser is Opera GX. Now, like its desktop counterpart, it comes with some amazing themes and it also comes with a bunch of useful features, just like its desktop counterpart. Since it is built with gamers in mind, there is a GX corner in the browser that will bring you the latest news related to gaming, word on the upcoming games and their trailers too. The default page even shows the day-wise release dates of different games for different platforms. It comes with a fast action button, Fab for short, which when tapped and held, opens a circle of options that help you navigate through the browser, all while using the phone with a single hand. Interacting with it also gives you a haptic feedback, making it easier to select different options. Opera GX also comes with Flow, where you can connect your phone's browser with your desktop browser without any email ID or account to share files, videos, and links across devices. The browser comes with ad blocking, cookie dialog blocking, and even crypto jack in protection for ensuring safety on the web. Another browser that looks really good is Yandex browser. But on top of that, it still goes big with functionality. It comes with a design that is both aesthetically pleasing and functional. The UI, the font and every element looks really good. You can also customize your homepage with widgets and also set up a homepage wallpaper of your choice. It's also very light on Rhyme usage. It comes with ad blocker and tracker blockers to ensure privacy. Opening an incognito tab requires pressing a single button and that's it. It also has a built-in translator which can translate any text on the page that you're currently browsing. And for easily reading articles, the browser also has a reader mode which removes all ads and links and only shows elements that are relevant to the article that you're reading. Next up, we have Vivaldi which is made for the power users, the tab warriors. Now, the way to handle tabs in this browser is completely different and it's not only helpful for the people with big phones, but tablet users as well as people who like to use foldables. Vivaldi is one of the best when it comes to tab management. It also has a feature called Tab Stacks, which allows you to group multiple tabs into a single tab, which can then be accessed with a single click. You can easily rearrange all the tabs as per your liking, much like a desktop browser. You can arrange all of your go-to websites in the speed dial folder for quick access to them every time you open a new tab. In case you want to search for something, on a specific search engine like DuckDuckGo, Google, or Wikipedia, just type in the first letter of the name of the search engine into the address bar followed by space, and the search will be made on that specific search engine. And along with this, you also get all of your privacy features as well. Next up, we have Aloha. And this browser is meant for those people who just want complete privacy while browsing through the internet. It comes with a built-in VPN, which you can use with ease and for free. You can also set a passcode along with biometric authentication to open the browser. There is also a private downloads folder, which is inaccessible to all other apps on the phone except the browser itself. And the browser also comes with Adblocker Plus built-in along with a very capable downloads manager. And last up, we have Ecosia. And it is a very capable browser, 
but along with being a browser, it also contributes to a great cause. The browser is built to ensure transparency and its operations are completely transparent. It uses the revenue from advertisements placed in the search to plant trees around the world and even has a counter on their website, which shows the number of trees that have been planted. They also show the proof of all their revenue being entirely used to battle transparency. Apart from the great purpose it serves, it is also quite a capable browser. It comes with a built-in ad blocker and a very capable downloads manager. The browser also does not profile you or track your location or sell your data. And well, that's pretty much it. The download links to all of these browsers can be found in the description box. And if you like the video, like it, maybe consider subscribing if you found a great browser. And well, I'll see you in the next one.